Since we've been having such good weather, I want to stay on topic from our last week's episode talking about street bike products. And today I'm going to be talking to you about the Recluse manual and auto clutches for V-twin engines. This covers everything from the Harley Street models, the Big Twin, the Milwaukee 8, the Sportster, as well as the Indian Scout. I'm going to start with Recluse's manual clutch. So this is a torque drive clutch pack. It replaces your steels and frictions. And compared to the OEM clutch, which comes with nine frictions that are aluminum based. Um, it comes with 15 torque drive friction plates. That's six more than the OEM clutch. So with your OEM clutch, if you have a built motor or you need more clamping force, what you would do is change out your Belleville washer for a stiffer one. And this will clamp harder to hold the clutch together and stop it from slipping. But what this does is add a very stiff clutch lever to an already stiff clutch lever. So with Reclu Recluse's torque drive clutch pack, you're increasing the torque capacity by adding more plates without sacrificing clutch pull by switching to a stiffer Belleville washer, washer. So this gives you ability to handle a much higher torque capacity without giving up anything on the other end. It also comes with the basket inserts, which protect your basket from notching. So you never have to worry about basket notching again. If you want to step into the auto clutch, uh, they make the Radius X for this model. Uh, as well as for the street models, the Milwaukee 8 and the Indian Scout. And for the Sportster, Recluse offers a Cori XP auto clutch. So this replaces your hub, your pressure plate, it converts it to a six coil spring clutch, which makes a big, bit better of a clutch feel, um, but gives you the auto clutch function. So the auto clutch works off centrifugal force and it opens and closes an auto disc with your RPM. So when your RPM drops to an idle range, the disc closes and the clutch will just spin on itself and as you increase the RPM the disc opens up, engages your clutch and you go. The benefit to this is that when you're stopped at a light you can leave the bike in gear and not have to pull on the clutch lever because your RPM has dropped. The bike will just sit there and as soon as that light turns green you roll on the gas, the, the disc opens up and you go. So there's no more sitting at a light holding in that beast of a clutch lever, uh, going through traffic trying to open close, open close, open close. You can just roll on and roll off the, the throttle as you see fit. The Radius X also comes with torque drive friction plates so it has a slightly higher than stock torque capacity. Uh, as well it comes with the basket inserts saving your basket from notching. Now when we go demo this at dealerships or we do bike shows, the most common comment that we get from Harley riders is that they already know how to use the clutch, they already know how to ride, and if you don't want to use the clutch, you maybe shouldn't be riding at all. Um, and my comment back is always that just like an automatic car, yes you can continue to pull the clutch lever in, use it all day long if you want, but why? Uh, the clutch functions amazingly, it engages and disengages amazingly. You can use the clutch lever if you want, you just don't have to. If I installed this in your bike and didn't tell you, you would continue using your clutch lever and not even notice it was there. It's a great addition to make your bike a little bit easier to use um, and a bit more functional in slow moving traffic. Uh, so if you have any questions about the technology, give us a call, hit me up in the comments. I will comment back if you have questions and keep riding. Oh,